I'm a missionary in Egypt. One day, I got a call from a man who introduced himself as Gloria's father. Last July, while living in South Sudan, he went to a hospital with his daughter, Gloria, who suffered from pain. It was found out that she had swallowed a piece of iron a long time ago. Thanks to the help from churches and neighbors for surgery fee and airfare, they came to Sudan where medical treatment was better, but the operation went unsuccessful. They came to Egypt with the remaining $200, but couldn't afford the necessary operation. That's why he called me for help. I went to several hospitals with Gloria, but received no positive response. So I asked for help from Korea. Fortunately, one of the big hospitals in Seoul said it can accommodate and treat Gloria. Thanks to the prompt work by the Embassy of the Republic of Korea and the hospital, Gloria and her father were quickly granted the entry visa to Korea. However, as the COVID-19 situation got worse, the Egyptian government shut down the airport and the Korean government canceled all the short-term entry visas of foreign nationals. We were in despair, but with the help of the embassy and the Korean community in Egypt, Gloria's family received the visa again, and we finally took the plane to Korea. Gloria had an operation in Korea and is now in recovery. I would like to thank all the people who made Gloria's miraculous journey possible.